Because I got shield broken somehow. It was by the back step, but like... I don't understand how that shield broke me. That was shield related. Which is why I'm thinking it's a hit, because the shield blocks as you attack with it. And I was mid-attack and then that happened, so I'm thinking it would count as a hit. Eventually, Wesley. That's the dream. I mean, I've been staggered by the Asylum Demon's backstep twice, so... Like, I know it can hit you, but that didn't do any damage to me, so it wasn't... It wasn't the same thing. Yeah, just don't get staggered. Wow, idiot. Because it's on different audio tracks. So I just want music um, other than the game. And then it won't be like heard and copyrighted and whatever. And I don't just want to like mute the um, sound for whoever watches the VOD. That's kind of rude, in my opinion. Music. Well, 
But yeah, I'm just gonna wrap the partisan later. Well, I do what I do, and I'm too lazy to change it. Because it's not like it makes my play any better or worse. Well, yeah, if you're in a Discord call, that's something different. I hope our run wouldn't be invalidated by someone unrelated just saying something dumb, though. That would be kind of petty. I think I can get, like, guaranteed plus four crystal dagger. Like, if I, uh, break the stray slab. I need to kill, like, one extra thing, or get... A lucky Titanite drop, or a lucky Trunk drop, but... Um... It was Rapier. Because I use S-Doc on, uh, Sif. Because that's the only thrusting sword I can get that early. Uh, easily at least. And then a Rapier was like 100 damage better than Mailbreaker. Overall, S stock would be slightly better, probably. Because I mean, an unusable weapon, I think I two parried Gwen with a enchanted S stock, plus three maybe. And like 70 int. Dude, how is the lizard alive? Like, there's no way. Like, there's actually no way the lizard didn't die. What the fuck? Where does he fall to that he survives? I literally watched him fall from the branch. Sixty levels, yeah. What's that? Uh, Godric's Great Rune, Vow of, uh, or Oath of Vengeance, or whatever. Um, fucking, uh, I don't even know what else. Too much.
the physic. That's like another 20 levels. Man, the talismans. There's more other than that? What the fuck? I guess there's uh, stat boosting gear as well, probably. Yeah, like in DS2. It's actually kind of ridiculous. Plus 5 faith helm, what the fuck? Isn't there like a plus 8 in helm? silo yes and I assume you just have what show was it <clears throat> also how you doing emotionally reeling I assume Isn't that the weird, like, basically porn thing that's, like, currently airing? No? Oh, is it something else? Oh yeah, no, that's a different thing. What is the one you're talking about? Yeah, no, I... It's the only thing I've ever fucking, uh, heard of for, like, the last month, so... <laughs> well, you know what you like, at least. Yeah, no, this is Madoka Magica, or whatever it is. I've watched, like, one episode of that. And I want to go watch it at some point. I just can't be asked at the moment. Madoka? Or the thing you just watched? Both, okay. Yeah, the... I actually uh, heard a term I fucking love for that, the tragical girl. The tragical girl genre. I found that fucking hilarious. Yeah, it just really depends where you look, uh, Pokwo. It's like you find shit that's just like. Oh, shit. Just like out of nowhere. I can't read Japanese, Pokwo. Be English in this chat. I'm, I'm a normie, come on. Yeah, I've never heard of that one, Pokwo. What's it about?
The rock anime. All I can think of when I hear that now is, uh, Bochi. I, I just see the fucking terrible, uh, Bochi the Rock memes or whatever it is. my mind goes to the worst version, but, you know, we're not going there. Is it, like... Slice of life, Pokwo, kind of, or is it like different? Slice of Geode? The fuck are you even on about? Cause the rock? Haha. <laughs> Very funny. Oh, uh, fucking, what is it? The Akiba Maid Wars. That one was fucked up. Yes, I got it, Silo. Like, I thought that one was just gonna be, like, funny, haha, uh, maids killing each other, but then it was like, what the fuck. I saw the fucking vomiting scene before I watched the show, and I found it hilarious. <sighs> Hold on, somebody is texting me. Yeah, it was, it was fucking crazy. Like, the first few episodes were pretty much slice of life shit. Like, even with the fucking insane concept. And then it just turned into not. It was pretty short as well. Okay, good, I did send the elevator down. I was like, wait, did I send the elevator down?
literally a better script for gargoyles with hand axe than battle axe. It's like it's genuinely so fucking easy to script gargoyles with just a normal plus five weapon. Oh shit, hold on ritual. Give me a sec. I'll give you a shout out uh, once I'm down the elevator. How was stream though? What was that shit about Linux? Uh, Raven Invasion, Alien, hey, how you doing? Yeah, but how is stream? Yeah, but, um, I guess for the people who don't know, um, Ritual's a DS2 god, go follow him. Um, and I guess for everyone coming in with the Ritual Raid who doesn't know me, hey, I'm Caddy Rana, you can call me Caddy. Um, I do DS1. We're doing SL1, Weapon Relay, all bosses, no hit, right now. What, he does Jeff Jump? Yeah. Pretty good, apart from your being fucked for some reason. What is, like, different about using Linux? I forgot to upgrade. Give me a minute. Gotta upgrade. I'll be back to murder you in just a moment. Take things to work, but overall almost the same. Okay. This is the thing about this run, is there's so much shit to remember. What is he doing? Is he, like, struggling to get back? <laughs> I leashed him on accident. I won't have to remember, yeah, SL1, no upgrade, weapon relay. That'd be a fun time. Even run lives with auto splitter and all that. I mean, I don't even do that to, to begin with, so. I'm literally too lazy to figure out how to set it up. Honestly, like, leveled weapon relay plus zero might be interesting. I might do that at some point if I get really bored. But, like, I'm not really a huge fan of doing, oh, the same run but plus zero. Like, I can do it, but... I don't think it's all that interesting. <laughs> all the way back to Asylum. Yeah, do early pinwheel to justify going there early for Ring of Fog to get, um, fucking rusted iron ring. 
Everyone needs to do that. Hitful and glitchful, yeah. I do not doubt that. <clears throat> I I do not doubt that for a second, Silo. Oh, you're getting hit at ONS? Just do fucking uh send skip so you can get to them earlier. Five head. Oh, you don't want to fight four kings? Just uh, wrong warp to the kiln, Lamau. Exactly what you would say. <coughs> I'm dying. There is no hope for me. In my will, I leave nothing to Silo. He knows what he did. Yeah, you stopped running DS2 Rando for every stream, Silo. That's why you don't get anything. Walking is pretty slow, pull up wings and cheat engine. Nah, just make like triple character speed with infinite iframes. how to do the poop walk, dude. I think I'd rather not. I do not want to be the not so proud uh, owner of the world's first poop walk all bosses no hit. Do it? No. I refuse to learn glitches. They're too much of a pain. Got the first jump once, nice. Didn't even take that long. I'm not worried about like time investment, I just don't care about learning glitches or uh, like really difficult skips. Okay. 
Nah, I do that with my uh, 20 something no hit runs. Or wait, no, that's how I tell people I don't have a life, never mind. Sorry, I got the two mixed up. I mean, it's an honest mistake. Hold on. Or hold on. Fucking Lamau, I was laughing at that lizard for uh, getting hit off. Self roast, I know what I'm about. I know what I am. Hello. That snake seems to love following me if I hit him with uh, the spear. Maybe it's the elemental, or maybe it's something else. But he doesn't really seem to follow when I hit with fist. No hitters need to start doing that for the definitely worth it, like, what's this, 5k? Yeah, 100% worth it.
weird. He is way behind. He shouldn't be this far behind on the cycle. Whatever, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna run to the restroom once I'm at the bonfire. Classic. I feel like I'm a dog, and I've like fucking Pavloved myself into uh, going to the bathroom every time I get here. back.
Now time for this strat that I tested like 20 times to fucking fail. Yep, that's new RNG. Yikes. Yeah, that's kind of scary. When you get like really bad RNG like that where he follows literally immediately, that's pretty scary. <laughs> yeah, have fun with the suffering, Pokwo, and thanks for good luck. Good luck with the practice. Is that even R2SR? It is, just barely. What the fuck? Why are you right there? Hey yo Makaias, how you doing? Um... I guess I'll upgrade first. I really don't know if upgrading there is worth it. I don't really know if it saves a hit on phase 1. Because phase 2 doesn't really matter. Also, um, Yomikaze, 
I don't know if you saw, but I did get weapon relay all bosses. Um, so that's in the about if you're interested. Because I, I know you mentioned it to me. Yeah, thank you. It was... I don't know. I mean, level kind of felt too easy, but SL1 feels uh, kind of fun. Master? No, not really. You should see some of the fucking hits I take. Like, I'm... I'm decent at this game, and that's about as far as I'd take it. Decent, yeah. Like, I know that probably sounds insane, but like, no, I'm, I'm not that good at this game. Like, I'm, I'm fully aware I probably sound a bit crazy saying I'm just decent, but I, I really feel like I'm not that good. Once I can do, like, what Zelda does, then I'd say I'm maybe a master. Because... He also kind of made a good point with, like, um, a master would, like, basically know all the different facets of the game, as in, like, PvP, speedrunning, whatnot. And I only know, like, no hit and casual, so... Guard, I'm not well rounded. I can't even see what Ornstein's doing, so I can't, like, punish in good conscience.
again, I can't see what he's doing. So I can't punish confidently. was going to get blocked by Smo's hammer, I probably would have punished again. Trying to do DS3 hitless, better than me with uh, a different run. I mean, just because I'm better in one area doesn't mean I'm like a, a master, though. That's the thing. It's like I'm pretty good at no hit, but that's probably as far as I would extend it. Thanks to GG Parno. Hope you're doing well, dude. You have to use um, weapons you don't have the stats for. I use probably close to 10. Yeah, it's not great, but I make do. Mm. 
Okay, let me, like, actually drop, uh, the shit that I've already used. I should probably do that, like, after I've done Quaylag. Because it's not like I need a weapon to do it. And it's better to just do it earlier. Yeah, and I mean, I skip quite a few weapons I actually can wield uh, Parno, just because it's kind of annoying to get them. Like, I could get the Dark Hand, sure, but I don't. I could get the Blacksmith Hammer, sure, but I don't. Chosen Undead. I remain here. Thanks so good luck. <clears throat> oh right, they do this if you shoot too fast. Oh no, okay, I guess he fell. to run? Uh, maybe. I won't for a long time though. Because I don't think it's really that enjoyable. I mean, I don't, like, I'm gonna do it eventually, probably, just, like, for completion's sake. As in, like, oh, I've done this stupid run. I mean, the thing with Master Run is it's not even hard in any game except for, uh, DS1. Or I guess DS2, because you don't really have iframes and the fights are longer. But DS3, you just abuse the shit out of bleed, and it's not that difficult. It's basically the same as just using a bleed weapon. It's like, once you've done it at New Game, you've done it at New Game Plus. And it's like, it hardly matters at that point. It's like, I wouldn't even say it's challenging in any game other than DS1. And maybe DS2 if you do it like all bosses, but... You know, nobody's gonna do that. Hmm. 
like, I don't even like that Gino named it the Master Run. I think that's stupid. I don't really think it needed a name like that. I think it just needed to be called the restrictions that it was. Because it's not like it's the hardest run that can be done, you know? And I guess I'm probably nitpicking, but like, whatever. like in in DS1 you literally need to do hyper mode for four kings because they're RNG like that's that's less skill and more annoying bullshit it's like if four kings didn't exist then sure they would be like mostly skill but I don't know Plus, I guess, like, a run being challenging isn't really the end-all be-all, you know? I'd rather do runs that are interesting uh, than challenging. Like this. This is a this is a good mix of both, and I'm I'm enjoying it so far. And uh, maybe doing leveled weapon relay plus zero would be interesting as well. And I'd I'd probably enjoy that, you know. But things that are like really boring routing plus they're just annoying it's it's like i don't i'm not gonna enjoy that and i guess the same for tedious routing as well and this is like pushing it a little bit like this run is pushing into like kind of tedious routing territory Did I drop the Kestis or not? No. So I don't know. I mean, like I said, I'm probably gonna do it at some point. Just because I hate myself, but... I'm not gonna enjoy myself. And I'm gonna call it a piece of shit run, because it is. Like, talk to Blaze if you want to know how shitty the run is. It's like, he's he's the one who knows more about the run than pretty much anyone for DS1.
so after this, um, I guess I trade, or I, I feed the red chunks, and then buy whatever green shards I need. Oh shit! Hi! Way to drop in on me. Alright, kill him. Okay, that's concerning. I didn't get, like, staggered by that guy, right? I don't think I did. I guess I need to be... Uh, less careless with those guys. So, I'm doing Nido, Butterfly, and then Sif. And then I'm going to... I guess for now I'll just buy 30 green shards, or 24, I think. Let's buy 26 just in case. And 18 of these. Let's buy the Giant's Halberd.
So how many green shards do I have now? So it is three per, okay. So now I get Scythe, Broadsword, and S-Stock to magic plus five. And then I come back up, and then I go to Nido. Grab the S stock. Because be, otherwise, we're going to have to come down here again. I've done this bit before, and I don't want to do the bit again. Let's actually remember the route, dude. Just use your brain for a quarter of a second. Christ. Okay. Reinforce the broad sword. A stock. We'll bring broadsword, a stock, and scythe up. Imagine actually remembering my route, that would be insane. As if that's gonna happen. I was coming here to sell him some shit, but I guess not. I can just break down the white chunks at this point. That's just free money, basically. Or I guess free soul saved. cheating by the way. <laughs> I love that. <sighs> Welcome back Shogun. Hope you're doing well dude.
Okay, this is like significantly more, because last time I had it at plus four, and now it's at plus five. Before the running in R1 follow up was like 180, this is like 25 more damage. That's actually pretty significant. there. I don't know how the hitbox is to the to the side of him. I need to like actually look into that a little bit because I, sh I need to know if I can be like not rolling that. Because that's actually like useful information. caddying wanting to know like the most fucking niche information ever and trying to justify it by saying it's it's useful no it's not hey dark lord how you doing nice i missed Failed wiki, yeah. Doesn't know every hitbox. <coughs> Only knows most hitboxes. Was I just hitting for more? Or what is happening? happening. Pants grab, this is what's happening. <coughs> Bastard sword? Nah. It's too much work. I could use it in this run, I have the strength. And as long as I have the strength that I'm pretty much cool with using it. Don't treat me like some withered old snake.
I'm not sure what kind of wither old snake he's talking about, but... Okay, so I'm gonna need to upgrade the partisan and the long sword. He is, yeah, he is a withered old snake. Can you just shoot, dude? Dude, do something. Fucking shoot. My god. What is this, like, shenaniganry? Always frampting. There is a fucking meme I saw that's like a weird dog that looks like Framped. And the caption is me, uh, King, King Seeker Framped whenever I feed him a dung pie. And it's like the dog giving like a judgmental look. And I, it's just the funniest shit. sword. The brooding sword. Because it never gets used because it's too fucking basic. Because who the fuck would use the broadsword? Feeding him chunks only. Yeah, I gotta keep him on a strict chunk only diet. I mean, I feed him coins as well, and humanity. Copper coin, 1,000 souls. I think the sword is like not long enough or I was out of position. I mean either way. Doesn't really matter. Are you low enough to start doing bombs? That's what I don't know, which means I pretty much can't punish uh, the flyover.
It also means I need to stay closer to the butterfly. Shit, dude. How? How'd I miss? Like, actually, what? Ugh. Do a laser. I might be able to punish on that. Damn. Ugh. That was close. How is that missing? Like, actually. What the fuck? Whatever. That was stupid. That was a fucking annoying butterfly. Join the Covenant, <clears throat> send Shiva down. I don't think I need to get that soul, so I'm going to skip it for now, I can always come back. I forgot to get the fucking partisan. Whatever, I'll buy something from Shiva, fuck's sake. I'm stupid, dude. <coughs> it's a gaping dragon, it doesn't really matter. But since I have to buy that, I guess I will go pick up that soul after Sif now. Because Shiva's shit is all very expensive. Classic fucking back hopping asshole. Nice.
thanks to Gigi Riotto. Hope you're doing well. I'm doing all right. I guess I can grab the winged spear rather than the partisan, or rather than the uh, something from Shiva. So I guess I probably didn't have to buy that. So I need to upgrade the long sword and the winged spear. And then, so that's just 20 green for now. So I have six, seven, eight. So I only need to buy 12. And I can also buy the Twinkling Titanite. Well, that doesn't really matter, because I have to come here before Four Kings anyway. Twinkle, twinkle, little cat. No. It's little star. Jeez. Get it right. Yeah, that is how no hit runs work. Bye patches, bye patches. Dude, how are you asleep already? What the fuck? <laughs> Actually, how? Do I even use the war pick on this run? I, I genuinely cannot remember. Um, so long sword. Also, I love how my first two splits are literally half of the run, maybe more. Like, both time-wise and boss-wise. I think that's fucking hilarious.
I will never not front load my splits. It is genuinely not possible to not front load your splits like that. Uh, because everything before ONS doesn't really matter because ONS is the start of the run. And then um, Butterfly, Sif, uh, Taurus, Capra, and Gaping Dragon are all basically the same boss. And then uh, Pinwheel and Stray are also just very easily lumped in with them. chunks do I have? I literally only need one more and then I've got uh, plus plus four crystal dagger for Manus. Strum. Be right back. Alright, I'm back. So I have Magic Longsword, Magic Wing Spear. Let me check my notes real quick. I think they verified one of my runs. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's get back to it. Back abuser, yeah. The I'm back abuser. Also, a uh, piss abuser, I guess. Abuser, abuser, yeah. It's gonna become a singularity soon.
This is definitely slower in terms of running sections, like doing more running sections, but I think it's going to be better for me. Because I'm not going to be fighting the Golden Golem for 10 minutes. Genuinely no clue how much um, how that drop was. It was like exactly RTSR. Did the Hydra shoot at all? Oh great, the Hydra doesn't have volume. I don't know why Hydra doesn't have volume. That's just awesome. This is so awkward. It's it's so fucking awkward playing when there's like no volume. I didn't like turn something down on accident. Right? Because like I hear my own footsteps. It doesn't even kill. Typical Hydra. I mean, typical Hydra is like awkward, sure, but like it's not this awkward. That's so odd. What the fuck? What the fuck was that? Like, really? So don't get greedy. Yeah, this is significantly better. Do I even need to talk to Dusk? Like, I, I genuinely don't know. I played this game for like fucking 1500 hours and I have no clue. Yeah, I mean, if you kill her, you can still get back. 
You can, yeah, like, I know you can kill her and still get in, but, like, if she's alive, do you need to talk to her? Also, hey, uh, Ogre, hey, Sil, Silzex. No, I was, I was asking if that's your name. <laughs> Sorry. I was asking if that's how you say your name, because I'm really bad with names. Sorry, I'm... I pronounce names so badly that I get self-conscious about it at this point. <laughs> I feel bad when I mispronounce names. Talking is mandatory. I mean... I don't know. I think you can kill her. It's like, I don't know. Um, I guess let's kill this lizard. And if he gives me a chunk, I don't need to do anything down there. If he doesn't, then I'll just go get the um, chunk from the guy. Yep. Okay. Guess we're getting this chunk. All this for a plus four crystal dagger. Dude, attack. Hold on. Thanks for the follow. Sorry, I am on- I'm like reading on phone. So I need to like wait for it to like come in on the stream on the phone because I don't ha- Oh, that is bad. Cause like, yeah, I, I don't have dashboard up basically. Also, that's a very awkward camera angle. Yeah, I kind of expected to do more damage there. Like, it, it's not like this is a bad weapon by any means. It's like, that was awful. Also, nope, no shard. Okay, I need to get, um, fucking, I need to get a Lloyd's from, uh, the merchant. Uh, this is DLC. I always include DLC in all boss runs, because just doing vanilla is boring. Oh, nice. Like, I come up, they both immediately take out their swords. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, the only run I would probably ever do uh, vanilla rather than plus DLC is no roll SL1, no range. And that's because the DLC introduces RNG. Uh, you can, but if it doesn't kill him, which I really don't think Demon Spear would, um, you're just kind of stuck there, and you can't really do anything, except for get trampled. Which is why I never do drop attacks in these runs, because the risk of that is quite high, actually. Because when I fight Taurus, I'm pretty much always plus five. Not gambling, yeah. I'm not a gambler. I 
I'm a bitch. Um, so dagger, scimitar, rapier, and reinforced club. And I guess I'll get the bolts here as well. That's fine. Um, Lloyd's talisman. I think my routing run for this was like five hits, and one of those hits was like, uh, I realized that I needed a Lloyd's Talisman to get the Enchanted Falchion, so I'm like, I'll just spawn it in and out a hit, I don't care. <laughs> so one of my hits wasn't even a hit. I mean, granted I got hit like 50 times fighting the gold golem in uh, Basin, but that's because I was being lazy. And because I had literally like a fifth of the damage I had uh, when I fought him just now. Oh, that doesn't kill. Shit. Okay. That's... I guess I used broadsword last time rather than longsword. That's bad. Okay, I guess with uh, these guys up here, I'm gonna need to uh, backstab. Summon Griggs. Yeah, if only. Yeah, just get the run now. That's the plan, but if I don't, then for next time I need to know that. I need to know, use longsword on butterfly rather than fucking broadsword. Because apparently the damage difference is enough to matter. The goal is always to get the run now, and not care later, but in times where that is not possible, um, shit. Great. Well, this has just become annoying. Yeah, Wesley? You have worrying news? What is that? Is it that I'm trash? Don't worry, I've already heard that. gonna get hit? Maybe. I hope not, but maybe. It is always a possibility. Until Gwyn is dead. I don't know what way that... Oh great, are they aggroed again? What the fuck is happening? Why are they turned? I don't like that. Okay, I'm going back up. Spontaneous and cool about what? About getting hit or about getting runs? That's like, I don't know when I'm gonna get hit, dude. And I don't know when I'm gonna get runs. Oh, great. 
great. Did one of them fucking... Okay, none of them despawned. None of them did that weird despawn thing. Okay, I'm gonna... Yeah, this is why I was waiting until they were past the corner. Because they can do this weird shit with their fucking turning. Dude, why is this such a goddamn chore? If there was just one left, I wouldn't... I would just fight him. But when there's two, I'm not fucking risking it. About getting hit, yeah. At this point, I've played this bit up too much, so I can't get hit here. It's It's too predictable. Doing chores. Alright. Okay, they are quite separated at this point. Okay. Now, if you guys are done with the fucking weird turning, what was that? Like, fuck off. <laughs> I hate these guys. I hate these guys so much. They're such assholes. Just, it's not even, like, worth clipping, but it's worth being concerned about. Okay. I've been somehow clipped by that running attack, even like after strafing completely around to his back. So, I am- I'm not fucking with that. Yeah, Capra was being kind of annoying. But like, whatever. Yeah, the last thief was being weird. Alright, so I've not done this with the magic winged spear. So I just kind of have to hope this works, by the way. Because this strat is, like, fucked up on a good day. It seems like I'm doing more damage, though. Yeah, he literally did trick me twice. Oh my god, dude. Don't. I missed the dog because I wouldn't take my eyes off the butcher. That was so fucking concerning. What the fuck? That was actually so fucking concerning. I was, I was afraid of the butcher instaying me. So I just wasn't taking my eyes off him. And so I missed the dog twice. Somehow, the dog didn't turn and meme me. And somehow the butcher didn't instantly attack me. What the fuck? This run is so fucked up. This is why I need to practice things. Because when I don't practice, shit like that happens. What the actual fuck? Oh my god, dude. I hate that. What the fuck? 
I am reeling. <laughs> I'm actually reeling. What the fuck? That was so bad. Yeah, that's that's more fucking caddying, dude. Okay, we're not attacking again, because I couldn't... I'm pretty sure the channeler was dancing, but I'm not fucking with that. I already don't like this fight, when the channeler's alive. Yeah, time for gaping. much bombs abused, yeah. I'm becoming a, a team hitless member, because I can't do melee only strats. Nice. Nice. Dude, just let me cut that fucking tail. I don't want to have to dodge a tail swipe. I already don't like fighting gaping in this tiny little area. Ugh, lovely. Yeah. We're running into the unsafe zone. Done with this fucking split. Okay, so I need four more Twinkling, and... So get the star... Let's do... Nah. Nah. Let's 
So I did get the heavy crossbow. Uh, I can drop demon spear, I can drop that. So, I plus 10 the Simtar, and then I, so I should have 4 Demon Titanite, yeah, and then I get 4 Twinkling, then I plus 3 Quelag's Fury Sword, and I plus 5 the Gargoyle Halberd, or the Giant's Halberd, not Gargoyle's Halberd. Gives you nightmares, why is that? PvP. What the fuck even is that sentence, uh, Wesley? Like, unironically, what the fuck is that sentence? You're right, I wouldn't. Because I'm a normal person. We say, or I say, and then everyone laughs. I'm just gonna assume it's P uh, something weird with PvP and ignore it. Real G's. Well, I guess I'm not a real G, and I am unaffected by that. I don't know if I need Red Tear Stone for this, I just didn't test without it. Missing out, tragic. I miss out on life. What's one more thing? Sorry, that was depressingly real, but eh, it's already been said. Whatever. Prepare for another backstab. Dark Souls won't miss out on me. I wish Dark Souls would miss out on me. <laughs> Those aren't words.
I don't like this. I'm gonna get hit. Pretty close. Never played it. Yeah, I, I never did. That was very close. I did that very poorly and I managed my stamina horribly. I should. I Okay, I've played it a little bit because my friend is into it and I'm like, this is boring as shit. I was like, maybe it's because I didn't play it as a kid, but like, I find it boring. Yeah, it gets good after a thousand hours, dude. That's, uh, sarcasm, by the way. Because if it takes a thousand hours to get good, I don't want to invest that time. Not even two thousand hours, yeah, but... I would rather put 2,000 hours into Dark Souls than RuneScape, because at this point I'm addicted, and I can be doing, uh, like, fucking no-hit and whatever, rather than just, like, learning how to play RuneScape. Kingsfield 4? I don't even know what that is. That's I'm I'm fucking with you by the way. I know like sometimes I'm really stupid, but like I am capable of making jokes sometimes. thought I was serious for a moment. Yeah, no, like, I'm, I, I know, like, I'm really clueless a lot of the time, so that makes jokes like what I just made harder to land, that's just why I feel the need to point it out sometimes. It's like, I, I am capable of understanding things 
very rarely, and making jokes. Again, very rarely. Yeah, it's a different caddy, dude. This isn't the caddy we know and hate. Not capable of not getting hit though? Yeah, for real. You say, as I do, a very early roll. <laughs> Don't fucking jinx me, dude. How dare you jinx me. So 51. And 16. So 19. So... So just to confirm, I do mid-roll with that. Oh nice, he fucking aggroed. I may simply need to fight this guy. It's a terrifying thought. Easy they are. Are you coming or okay?
Okay, I don't want that other hollow aggroing to me, though. Okay. Dude, are you going to attack? I didn't like that. I don't like that. I don't think I can punish on the double. <laughs> Ugh! I misread that. I misread that attack. I should have gotten hit. Nice. That's what I'm really afraid of. This is why I hate using weapons I don't have the stat the strength for. Like, if I don't have the dex, whatever. But if I don't have the strength, it's so fucking terrible sometimes. And this guy is behaving so oddly, I don't know if it's safe to attack. Dude, do a fucking that, thank you. Dude, what is with this guy? Why is he so fucky? Pika melee and DS1 combat? Yeah. Nah, that would be dead angling. Dude, do a fucking attack I can punish. Please. For God's sake. Like, actually, fuck's sake, dude. Do something I can punish. That's why I don't like punishing anything other than the fucking horizontal, by the way. <sighs> I know you're not actually de -aggroed, so do your fucking thing. Genuinely the hardest part of the run, by the way, is fighting a golem when you don't have the strength to use the weapon safely. Like, in, in unusable weapons, I had the choice between Blacksmith Giant Hammer, which did a lot of damage, and uh, fucking Enchanted Estoc, which did nothing. But I didn't have the strength to use the hammer, so I literally chose to fight it with the fucking S-Stock, even though my damage was like a tenth of that of the goddamn hammer. Because it's like ten times safer. Like, do you run away or like move? Oh, my God. Are you going to turn this way or, like, what are you doing? Oh my god, stop baiting me into doing attacks. I hate you. I hate everything in this area. I hate this fucking piece of shit area, dude. Like, fuck using this weapon. 
Like, fuck this weapon and fuck this area. Why did I choose to use Giant's Halberd? Like, I know for, for Seath, but like, fuck me, dude, that's just bad. And I'm like, I'm not sure of myself. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing. Duke's cunts, yeah. I was like, did he not open? I can get to plus three if I grab um, this Tsomina. I've obviously uh, not done much routing on the back end of this run. <laughs> I think that should be pretty clear from how fucking poorly I'm playing. Because I'm literally just relying on previous knowledge. And hoping it doesn't fail me. I guess that guy's not gonna follow me down. So, I don't know if it's allowed to quit out uh, with that guy alive, but he's not aggroed to me. Like, very clearly not aggroed to me. So, it should be fine. I only hit one of them. Yeah, I should be able to get at least one of them without punching first. Lizard backstab. No, I'm not sure I want to either. That sounds cursed. Dude, how? Like, actually, how? Like, genuinely, how does it miss? Yeah, this is actual fucking skill issue, and it's kind of pissing me off. Okay, so... That's six blue, and how many green? Four. So one, two, three... I think I can plus four the Enchanted Falchion, which is pretty cool. Crystal Lizard's backstep. I honestly wouldn't doubt that, because DST is pretty fucked up sometimes. <coughs> sometimes. Mm. 
My health is 109, by the way. DS2, uh, like, went all in on the uniqueness. And I can appreciate that. Wow, that starts really far back. Let's just let's just not seethe. Let's not with like trying to sandwich me into tiny areas. He's just an asshole. No, Wesley. I only do that with the Redeem. Done with this piece of shit weapon. Yeah, nice try, except like not even. It's a terrible try. Oh, I need one more. That's so unfortunate. Okay, so upgrade... If there's anything redeemable about them, which is just false. Yeah, actually based as fuck. Welcome in, Sax. How you doing? Okay, so I need to buy nine. Yeah, I'm somehow hitless still. I don't know how, but you know, it's the runs going. Oh, I should. Uh, oh, I'm gonna post the clip uh, from earlier. Because there was something really fucked up uh, that happened with Asylum Demon. Don't sound too... I mean, I'm happy, but I wasn't expecting to get so far so fast. And this is a somewhat interesting run, so I'm a little bit conflicted. And also, I've not been executing very well, so... Okay, let me, let me look at my... Um, my list. So 9, 18, 27, 
Okay, so... 27 large shards. Uh, caddying is whatever the fuck it needs to be. Um, let's see. So... 9... 18, 27, 36, 45. So 45 of these. So... That should be correct. And then... 10, 20... So... 16. Caddying is like doing the like the correct thing, or like doing something in a terrible way but still having it work out. I guess that's that's a decent definition of caddying. Um, I don't need the war pick, by the way. So first, say I can drop that. I can drop the war pick. I can drop the giant's halberd. Um. So I need to plus 10 the crossbow, reinforced club, and dagger. Getting hit and throwing? Yeah, 100%. So dagger, reinforced club, heavy crossbow. No, I wouldn't. In fact, old caddy would never. So fame has changed me, but it's changed me to your benefit. So, what do you have to say to that? <laughs> Not a bad definition, Sax. Pretty accurate. You will not speak, because you know you're wrong. Let's see. One, two, three... So I have eight bosses left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Or no. I have ten bosses left. And I'm missing one of the weapons, so we're fine. What in the world are these emotes? <sighs> okay. Do not forget to pick up the Fire Sage Staff. Do not forget the Demon Staff. I forgot that in routing and I don't want to fucking improv a weapon for Sanctuary Guardian. Death Stranding reference. Never played it. Never seen it played. What's new, Caddy's Clueless?
is a stay. Yeah, see, I don't play things other than Dark Souls, so I would never get it. I would never. Could never be me. I did six Sundered Runs. Thank you very much. Get in. Please, don't do this. Well, he's doing it. Whoops. I meant to I meant to two hand. I'm used to two handing by clicking uh, with the bow. Six four hundred two Uh yeah it was Dark Lord. I did no HP damage runs in the game on easy mode. I did all three endings, uh and then I did uh one hundred percent completion plus all um, like all the, what are they called, bosses? Uh, like all the, all the harder version of the bosses that you need to wear the perk for. Eradicator. Yeah, it's down in my about. And it's all on YouTube as well. Don't forget the fucking staff! I say, unhinged. I think at this point, Sanctuary... Guardian is objectively the hardest fight. And since I forgot to, um, well, since I couldn't plus ten the dagger, I'm gonna need to make two more trips, um, at least two, maybe three, to the giant blacksmith rather than one or two.
No, Manus, you have like a weapon you can actually use. Um, blacksmith giant hammer, sax. So, Kalamita is literally one of the, f uh, or should be one of the freest bosses of the run. The only messed up parts of the run anymore are Sanctuary Guardian and killing, um, killing the, uh, blacksmith giant. I think I'm going to try to kill him with um, the Manus Catalyst rather than the Gargoyle Tail Axe. It'll save one trip. I just need to not greed punish. Because it's too slow to greed punish. The runner cheat? The, a runner named cheat? Or... Like, did you just, like, misspell the word cheat? Looks like, uh, no, I've never heard of him, no. Does he do hitless, or, um, what does he do? Did Bloodborne all bosses? Nice. Well, I'll have to check out the stream at some point and see uh, see the resemblance. Don't worry, I won't point it out to him. Won't ruin the joke. Though maybe I will ask for the fuck Ohio emote to be added. Just different tone of hair. All right. That's it's literally just him. He just dyed his hair. He wanted to shake off his reputation, do no hit instead, follow his true passion.
Alright, I'm gonna run to the restroom. I'll be right back. And I'll look at that uh, in a moment. Alright, I'm back. Also, um, funny thing, there was a guy in there, uh, like, pissing from the moment I went in to nearly the moment I left. <laughs> How do you piss for that long? Toy little bosses, yeah. No, but that's like kind of ridiculous though. It took me like 45 seconds, like, from entering to leaving. A blitz pisser. <laughs> Let's piss her. <laughs> That's a new one. Also, I forgot to uh, make the dagger crystal. I'm gonna see if uh, Leo Ring is worth using. Was doing like 105 and 147 or something like that. So let's see. So I do have the reinforced club. Thank you. 
not worth having on at all. I'll switch it out as soon as is convenient. was a boss I'd lose because I have uh, no resistance to pain. I'm not sure that's safe to punish actually. column eat. Maybe. I can't say I won't. I'm gonna try to make a liar out of you though, Wesley. this in on pace real quick. I forgot to. Oh, uh, thanks. Thanks, Ant. How you doing? Hope you're doing well. Uh, and for, for reference, I have Artorius, uh, Manus, Gwendolyn, Priscilla, Kalamit, and Gwyn left. It's like DLC and Orlando cleanup and Gwyn basically. Yeah, but thank you. Um, Artorius, Manus, Gwendolyn, Priscilla, Kalamit, and Gwyn. Those are the bosses in the order that I'm doing them.
such as DLC and Anna Orlando clean up and Gwen. Clowns to the left you, it's Sears on the right, here I am, stuck in the middle with Caddy. What an awful place to be, Sax. What a truly awful place to be. Also, I I like this song. Uh, I don't remember what it's called, though. So I did get that reference. Jimmy Eat World. That's an interesting name. Thanks, Ant. Yeah, but sorry to make you uh, do some shit for me when you come in. Hope you're doing well. Back, yep. And hopefully not gonna throw. How you doing, Kappa? Hope you're well. How's uh, DS3 going? the baby. I have never heard of that. <laughs> and that name is kind of concerning. Nah, that wasn't very good. Uh, thank you for the follow. I can't read your name because I'm in a fight and I'm going to miss it because I don't have a uh, dashboard up. Blarix? Sorry, I, I'm like glancing at the screen to try to catch the name. Yeah, but hope you're well. Thanks for the follow. going. I didn't like that. He started really early. Everything, yeah, that is your taste in music. And honestly, it could be a lot worse. It could be swans and only swans. Not even to <laughs> I don't know, I mean, I shit on swans a little bit. I think that counts a little bit. <laughs> swans is an interesting band. There are some things I like, and there are uh, some things I really don't care for. Dude, Sax is like the biggest fucking Swans fan ever. <laughs> I think you guys are twins separated at birth. I, I'm gonna be completely honest. Yeah, one time Sax requested a song in uh, Chris's stream. And then Dark Lord did. And then Chris is like, oh, don't worry, your song's gonna play in half an hour. 
Uh, Hems does. I mean, Hems kind of likes a bunch of shit, so like, and I don't mean shit as in like bad stuff, I mean like shit as in a bunch of different stuff. Okay, let's get going. Three albums. <laughs> How long that take them? Five days? Yeah, I'm always gonna joke about the length of the song, Sax. You gotta know me. You, you, you gotta know. I've never even heard of that, Sax, and I only know about swans because of you. Okay, I can't, like, read and play at the same time, so sorry, I'm just kind of gonna ignore chat mostly. Because, like, I am- I do not have the capability. It simply does not exist in my feeble mind. <laughs> yeah, donor walling. I'm I'm able to catch like little bits, but I can't like read the paragraphs that Sax is sending, passionately ranting about how good Swans is. And that's not because I don't want to hear Sax rant. That's because I just can't comprehend it. <laughs> I exaggerate. I'm just, I'm exaggerating because I think it's funny, but like, you know. I remember one time uh, you told me, Sax, you just found like someone randomly in a in a stream. I don't remember what stream you said, who like who also liked swans, and you you were just so excited about it. I thought that was really wholesome. Yeah, dude, you were you were actually so happy, and I'm I'm like. You know, it's weird, but it's it's really wholesome at the same time, so. Like, it's it's sax. That's just par for the course. But I mean, I guess I understand it. There are tens of us. <laughs> yeah, dude. I'm actually trembling in fear. I'm gonna take over the world. Bearer. I've never even heard of that band. See, this is the thing, I don't listen to things outside of my tiny little bubble of metal and rock, I guess, and anime bullshit. Oh, 
Okay. This was a mistake. I should have just backstabbed. I knew I would regret it. I knew I would regret not backstabbing. <laughs> oh, that was sketchy. Music for Dark Souls. I, I don't even need practice, I just didn't use RTSR there like I did in uh, normal, and I'm like, well, the crystal will make up for it. Do metal, but with more uh, soaring vocals. How about this? Um, I'll put on uh, an album. Just what album would you want me to play? And I'll put it on. Because I'm, I'm kind of interested now. Uh, no, that's my roommate. He's practicing guitar. Heartless, but start on track two. Okay. Ah, oh, what was it? Paul Bearer? I am enjoying this. I am liking this so far. Like I feel like if it was if this was playing on a speaker, I would be able to feel it in my gut. And I like that. This actually nearly doubled my the amount of damage I'm doing with uh, counter hits. Like my non counter heavy hits are doing the same as what my counter heavy hits were doing before. Nice attack transition, Manus. Yeah, yellow damage on a run like this. Actually unheard of. How you doing, Blaze? I should have closed distance more aggressively. I am enjoying 
Um, the music, by the way. I know I, I said it before, but... Now we're doing this. Dude, can you follow anything up? Like, I don't want to deal with you when you're like this, Manus. Like, please? Just piss off? Yellow damage, Pog, yeah. Um, things are going alright here. Um, I'm gonna turn the music down just a tad. Because that's like really loud. Yeah, but things are going alright here. Um, thanks for all the GGs. I am getting weirdly far in this run. And I'm not sure how to feel about it, but... You know, it's it's happening, so Did the music pause or is this just like a oh, the music did pause. That was weird. I don't know why. <sighs> Please, just let me get the jump. Okay, so I have the twinkling. I should have maybe rolled that, but... Uh, thank you for the follow, uh, Lilith. Hey, how you doing? Thanks for the good luck. I only have four bosses left. Yeah, you're always giving me uh, GGs in the Team Hitless Discord. <sighs> this fucking catalyst. God. Thank you for the follow, waiting for the name to pop up. Uh, Papa Palaka? 
Is that how you say your name? Uh, welcome in. Hope you're doing well. Oh, this is consistent. Dude, you should have seen my- I got hit to a fucking- Like, you know those club guys at the start of Blighttown? I got hit to one of those. And then I got hit to Quaylag earlier. It was bad. And then, um... I don't know if you ever look in, like, DS1 discussion or whatever, but, um, I had a weird meme, um, <laughs> thank you for the follow, hold on, wait for the name to pop up, uh, Tainaria? Sorry, I'm bad with names, I hope I said that right. But yeah, I had a weird thing where I attacked Asylum Demon with a shield as he backstepped, and I got, like, a weird, uh, block animation fist because I won't have any- I will never fucking do fist. Not even like, uh, Kirk Gauntlet fist. I will never do fist. I will move on to another game like a somewhat sane person would. Like three runs per week. I mean, depends on the on the runs. If I got stuck, I'd get like maybe one, but I'm happy if I get like even one. Because that's still like a, a crazy rate. Like I'm I'm very happy with um getting as many runs as I do. There's no point in attacking again. Caddying is like the most versatile verb I've ever seen, dude. Or is it not a verb? Crap. Well, I didn't four cycle like I hoped. Guess I'll be five cycling. Six cycling, never mind, because I'm stupid. <laughs> uh, that was dumb of me. I should have waited. Mouse and keyboard, nice. It is the best way to play. Dragonbone. Yeah, Dragonbone Fist is the first run I'm doing uh, when I get back to the weapon uh, runs. Only have four runs, got them over a year and a half. That's about what I did when I first started out. That's that's about the rate that I was getting stuff. Um, hey Casey, how you doing? Got made a banner a few days ago. <laughs> Uh yeah, dude, that stuff is cursed. Hey, I'm gonna I'm gonna show it in just a moment. Uh thanks so good luck, Casey. Glad to hear you're doing well. Um, because it was already redeemed, Shogun. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna show the most fucking cursed thing ever. Uh so this was made with AI. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, <laughs> that's all you guys get of it. That was made with AI, and I'm I'm gonna make it my channel banner at some point. Um, do the great bow. Um, at some point I'm gonna do dragon slayer great bow. Yes, and at some point I'm also going to do uh, goes great bow. I'm gonna do every weapon. That includes includes the great bows, that includes the crossbows. Boom. Uh, 
bow and no arrow is not possible. This isn't DS2. But yeah, uh, for both of the great bow runs, Lilith, um, they're both going to be cheated in at the start of the run because of uh, how I do my rules with weapon all bosses, uh, no hit runs. Um, my damage is coming from the magic infusion. Um, so just to show, uh, see I get basically nothing physical but everything magic. That's how I did uh, unusable weapon all bosses, because as long as your uh, elemental damage is not coming from a stat like intelligence or faith, um, then it will not be affected by not meeting the physical by not meeting the strength or dex requirements. But I prefer using weapons that I meet the strength requirement on, because then they don't swing very slow. Markish 2.0. I mean, I'm not gonna get runs as quickly as him. I, I th I'm pretty sure he got most of his runs pretty quickly, or at least from what I saw, he got him pretty quickly. I don't know if I'm gonna get runs as quickly as him, but I'll certainly try. My goal is to have all weapons done within about a year. I calculated. As long as I get like two runs a week, I can have it done within like a year. Yeah, the bouncing off of shit is like terrible, but I gotta make deal. And then I know uh, Lemon Cupcake is doing the same run, but all vanilla bosses. Yeah, thanks for good luck. Hopefully you will wake up to uh, an edit on my on pace just saying, got it. <laughs> With any luck. Also, uh, Ant, that is a requirement. Uh, for any on paces you post for me. You can't do like the the edit like he got it exclamation button you, you have to just like not say it's an edit and you just have to like tack on uh, got it at the end. There can be no fanfare allowed. <laughs> got it by the way. Yeah. Alright, Priscilla, Kalamit, and Gwyn left. Please get away from that wall, Priscilla. Cut. Nah, her tail's like impossible to hit unless you do it as the the first thing you hit, or during her uh, uh, breath attack.
Hey on Source, how you doing? People feet meon coggers. Those are the crown jewel emotes of my channel. Definitely no need to look into it more than that. Definitely not any uh, cursed to shit emotes or anything. Hey Soul Slayer, how you doing, dude? Uh, how was the uh, I think it was uh, Sekiro with the Senpu arts. Was that just casual or were you uh, routing for Hitless? I caught some of uh, Lady Butterfly. Seemed interesting. Casual. Nice. I barely use any of the uh, arts and whatever in uh, Sekiro. Because I'm lazy. Without Slorp Glorpin. <laughs> yeah, Slorp Glorpin and when the butt plug slips out of the party and the yada yada yada. Uh, that emote were the two that I didn't want mentioned, but I've already mentioned them now. So. You should do sword only, Giga Chad. I make copious use of, uh the prosthetics. If I was 37 minutes down. It's like jump only tier of holy shit. It seems I've gone uh, slightly overboard with buying bones, by the way. Just very slightly. Yeah, that's my roommate, uh, Ant. He's practicing guitar. Yeah, I mean, considering I'm in the room like 12 hours a day, I'm, I can't exactly reasonably say, uh, like, don't practice in this time. Because, like, if I say don't practice when I'm streaming, that's like, okay, then you can never practice. I'm not going to be a dick. Not, I, I don't care. You thought you were? What? You thought you were what? Hearing noises, yeah. People hallucinating. <laughs> Yeah, not in my stream. So this is where Wesley, our all-knowing seer, uh, predicted I was going to throw the run. So let's see if he was right. over what? The run or your career? The run. Yeah, we'll see. I told you I was going to try to make a liar out of you. That's a bad angle, Kalamine.
never lie? Well, we're about to see it. Please behave, Palamy. That was pretty close. That was not a good strafe on my part. And that was not a good bait on my part either. Dude, what is what is going on? Looks like Wesley was wrong. Thanks for GG's. Yeah. Colomy took a dive. Gotta ban Wesley for lying. Nah. If we had to ban people uh, for lying, you'd have to ban me. I'll look at that in a moment, Dark Lord. Paid actor, yeah, for sure. And banning me? For lying? Yeah, exactly. We're all a bunch of liars, dude. We'd all just be banned. Uh, let me... Let me look at what was... Uh, what is this emote, Dark Lord? Oh. The fuck? <laughs> I've never lied in my life. That's a lie. So let's see if I'm gonna throw to Gwyn. This should be either a 6 or 7 Peregwin. Ming rolled. Damn. I almost prefer that I'd have been Rick rolled. No parry, yeah. He would be genuinely the hardest boss in the entire series if you had to fight him no parry. To do no hit, at least. Nice, been working on your squats, dude. Clear this game, uh, what do you mean by that? So this is going to be a 7 parry Gwyn. It was so much worse before, it was like an 11 parry Gwyn before. I mean, I would hope this is not my first playthrough. I feel bad for the poor soul who does this as their first playthrough. And I'm impressed by the soul who does uh, as well as I am on their first playthrough. Nice. SL1, Weapon Relay, all bosses, no hit. Cool. GG. Uh, 
Uh, thank you for the follow on Source. 33523. That is so fucking slow. Oh my god.